So I know this is a lot of craziness, randomness going on, but I'll try to break it down. So crawl position right here. We want our wrist right underneath our shoulders. So we're not out here, we're not back in here. They're right underneath our shoulders. And when we're in a crawl position, our toes are the actual ones, the only ones touching the ground in our lower body. So we're tucking our toes under. We're keeping our knees in the front of our hips right here. We're right in line. Keeping our knees up right there in parallel position. So what's parallel? My torso's parallel, my shins are parallel, okay? So if I'm here, right underneath my shoulders, right underneath my hips, my toes are curled under. I'm here, that's a crawl position right there. So right there, that's a crawl position right there, okay? I'm keeping my back not sinking in, not caving up. Keeping it guys strong, so I should feel this side turn on the entire time. So, number one, crawl positions figured out. Number two, bird dog. What in the world is that? So bird dog right here, we're in a crawl position. So opposite arm, opposite leg. So we're here, touch, extend up, back in. Here, touch, extend up, back in. So what does that challenge? Oh my. I'm like sweating even doing this right here. It challenges your stability like crazy and your ability to get opposite arm and opposite leg extended, okay? So you start in that crawl position. Get to our right hand, we want our left leg. So for here, we want our left leg touching, extending up while keeping this guy parallel to the ground. So we don't want to open up either way to try to get our stability. We want to keep this guy parallel the entire time. So here, we're here, we're touching, opposite arm, opposite, opposite leg, extending up. What do I not want to happen? I don't want it to be our back. How many go? Okay, so here, we don't want this overextending, we don't want this flexing. We want to keep this guy strong. We're just moving our hips and our upper body. So here, squeeze my butt, come up. Back in, squeeze my butt, come up, okay? Another big key is we want to breathe out as we extend. So we're here, without the crawl position, we're here, touch, back in, touch, back in, okay? So it's a really complex and kind of difficult movement. So if the crawl position is too progressed, go to the straight quadruped, which is hands and knees. So we're here, touch, extend, touch, extend. Feel confident with that and then progress to the crawl position.